this is something new that I'm doing. Uh, this video is, is going to be fairly short, I believe. Uh, this is for uh, my friend, my friend GD. He is also a, a Lisa player, and he inquired uh, about. Um, he just wanted to see how I backdash, how I move, like a physical like recording of it. And I thought, okay, this is that's a great idea. I have never really recorded my movements. Uh, he said I move pretty quick. So I was like, okay, okay, okay. Like maybe this would be a good time to also show others how I move as well on pad. So and I always feel like there's, there's those, those of us that learn better by hearing and those of us that do better by seeing. So for those of you that uh, like both, uh, I will be doing that right now for you all. So sit back, chill, and enjoy my tutorial on the cuddle bag dash, which is just a normal bag dash, but my weird funky movements with pad <laughs> bag dashing with Elisa. I will start by showing a I should step back a little bit. Yep, I will show a very quick way that I like to move. So, like you can see, I'm doing back, back, down, back, 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 down, back, 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 down, back, back. So, I'll try and do it a little slower. So a little bit slower, as much as I can. <laughs> I'll try to do it even slower than that. And as you can see, sometimes what I'll do is I'll backdash, I'll backdash, then I'll hold back. Backdash and hold back, so I'm blocking. So that I'm still able to block, so it covers me. So when I'm doing the, the back down back back I always feel that the the back puts me uh, back in a neutral position so I'm not moving I just it's holding me back it's resetting me to standing because the other motions that are happening is the down back which is me ducking and the other motion which is back so these are these are two different actions Yep, back, down, back, back. So I'm moving and I'm doing down, back. So if I'm not trying to do rapid back movements and down, back, it's just resetting me. So I'll do a, a, I'll do a quick one, the way I do it at least. On this side, same thing. It's back, down, back, 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 down, back, 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 down, back, back back down back back and that's just the slower version of how I would normally do it so now I'm going to go forward and I'm going to do it a little quicker back down back 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 down back 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 down back 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 down back back as you can see my thumb is staying very <clears throat> is staying on the on the back button but it but the middle of my thumb or more like the like right here is cradled between the <clears throat> excuse me between the back button and this lovely down button here so it's so the tip of the little this part right here of my thumb is sectioned right here on that back button but where callus is used where callus is formed which is all the time right here when with for us pad players it's cradled right between <clears throat> that down button and that back button. So, so that's how I'm able to move quick because I'm able to access both that back and that down and the in-between. The in-between, the down back is is where I'm telling you to section yourself, uh, to, to put yourself, to place yourself. That's the section that you should always have the middle of like, like this part of your thumb on is right here. It's really important, see? So you can always reach back and down back like this. Yeah, it's key that you, depending on how big your thumb is, but 
for my thumb, I always have to make sure this, th like the tip of my thumb, like the round top part of my thumb is on that back, remember, on, on, the, on the back button, and cradle, it's cradled in between the back button and the down button, and then this part of my thumb is on that down button, that lovely, lovely down button. <laughs> so you can see. Hey everyone, I hope you all enjoy the video, uh, the slash tutorial. This is my first time doing something this like like instructional and this quick. Um, if you all like what you saw here today, uh, uh, I will make a bit more content in regards to uh, Elisa setups, um, Elisa tech in general, uh, just theories I have on some of the characters moves, some of her okay options, uh, just some of, even discussing her more creative, like just more creative approaches to the character, regards to the wall, things like that. So if you all enjoyed this uh, small little preview of my backdash tutorial explanation, then show me some love and tell me what else you would like to see from me specifically and my characters, uh, I'm more than willing to give more tips and more knowledge. Uh, yeah, I've, I've really enjoyed teaching it and and, and um, kind of giving more feedback to people. So yeah, just let me know. Uh, put a heart, put a whatever, put some criticism on what I could fix or anything. Thanks guys, appreciate it. See you next time.